Well, hello, everybody. I am Spectacular, the Silver Stacular. This video has me putting my coffee down just for a moment because I want to show you this new piece that I got right here, this stackable silver that is not getting enough love at all. This thing is super cool. One of the new stackable pieces that it came out, I think at the end of last year, technically, but this year it's still very much hot. It is the Aztec calendar or the sunstone. Now the real artifact is in a museum in Mexico, um, Mexico City, I believe. And definitely check out information about the sunstone because it's fascinating what they believe it's all about. Uh, this is a really, really super cool piece. And now it is stackable. I got two, and I'm also going to talk about something with these right here that nobody at all has discussed. Something you can do with these that has not been found out. You're going to learn about it here for the first time in this video. So stay with me, though, as we talk about these really cool new stackable pieces of silver. Well, hello, everybody. I seek to educate and entertain through my journey of collecting coins and stacking precious metals. I encourage you to subscribe and please stay with me on this journey. I am Spectacular, the Silver Stacular. And now I got these right here from jmbullion.com. I'm happy to get them. I want to take one out if you don't mind. It comes in these little plastic, uh, you know, protectors right here. But in order to stack them, I'm going to have to take them out. Look at this thing. It is absolutely just detailed beyond belief. So it has a three-dimensional, you know, detail to it right there, as you can see. Super high relief, super cool, and just fantastic. When you look at information about the actual Aztec sunstone and like look at the you know pictures of the actual artifact, try to match it up with this thing right here because they do an amazing job of basically copying it to perfection. Now the actual um, stone does not have the areas that are raised up like this to my knowledge, the certain little spots, but it definitely actually increases what this thing might have meant to be looking like um you know the, the the stone what they may have anticipated it looked like because i supposedly it was even uh painted then back in that day um who knows right i wasn't alive back then i know most of my viewers although you're older according to the analytics you're not that old come on now look how awesome this thing is so i seen this and i was like there's no way it can look that cool. There's absolutely no way. While I'm talking about it, I'm going to take the other one out because I want to try to stack them. It says they are stackable, and if they are, oh man, just how much cooler is that? Look at the detail for a minute. It's just so, can I even zoom in a little bit more? Look how crazy that looks. All right, I'm back. I got the other one out, and uh, again, I do want to say these are from jmbullion.com. I'll put a link down in the description for these because I do want you to be able to find these. I think these are awesome. I think you should definitely own one, if not two, just so you can stack them. Uh, they are super, super pretty. I had no idea they were going to be this special, uh, but they are. They are very awesome. I'm looking at this one right now in my hand. Uh, I guess you want to see it too. Okay, so here is the one that I had in my hand out of the plastic too, and just the detail is crazy on these. And again, I'm going to show you something that nobody else has talked about after I try to stack these because I want to see if they do stack. It claims that they can be stacked. So let's let's put it to the test right here. So it goes great on my little stone little platform I have right here. So there's that. And let's see if they stack. So far, um, the other stackers that are out there have stacked so nicely. I believe they're all by the same company. The South Korea makes these. And uh, they're doing a fantastic job on the stackers. Look at that. It does stack. It stacks great. Look at that. Uh, no problems. Let me pick them both up. Okay. Yeah, it stacks tight. They're nice and tight. Doesn't doesn't move. Doesn't wobble. Yeah, very, very nice. I mean, you could have a bunch of these. And they're two-ounce pieces now. Uh, triple nine fine silver. And they stack together very, very nice. So you could probably have, I don't know, 50 of these right here before you even notice a spot filling up in your safe or any kind of storage you have. I mean, they look great. Look at that. Oh, it doesn't even wobble around. They just fit so nice. I, I'm very, very impressed by these. Um, so if this is, I'm pretty sure it is the South Korean uh, mint, the Comsco mint that is making these right here. If indeed that is you guys, I don't know if you guys can... Um, understand English. Uh, I can't understand Korean, so we're going to try our best to, to work together on 
on communication, but I just want to say, Bravo, you guys are doing a fantastic job. I think that everybody could own one of these right here and really benefit. And you can benefit too by going and learning more about the Aztec Sunstone and um, finding information on the internet about it. It's just a lot of history, a lot of neat stuff going on there that find out that this stuff actually exists. Look at look at how they both right there working together. And they, oh, so cool. It's, it's amazing, it's a two ounce piece. And I, you know, it's just so big for a two ounce piece and it's because it's so thin and spread out. Um, and I guess the stacking part on the bottom, how it's kind of hollowed out almost, it makes it to where it's can be a two ounce piece. But anyways, the one thing that nobody's talking about with this right here that I, I really want to let you guys in because you are my viewers and I appreciate you all. But look at this. I'm going to show you this right here. When you get in very, very close to it, you're going to notice this right here. You're going to notice that it feels like you're in a scene from Star Wars. And it goes like this. <sighs> Red Leader, this is Silver Leader. We're going into the Death Star now. We'll be firing upon it shortly. All right, huh? It feels like you're in the little Death Star scene right there with the TIE, or the, yeah, the TIE Fighters going after the X-Wing Fighters. And you're just... Doesn't it feel like that? Whew, I know, okay. All right, so yeah, nobody knew that. Now you know it. Um, you wish you didn't know it, but there it is. Look how pretty. It's just so cool. And I know that um, a lot of people will remember those other videos I put out when those stackers come out. I'm just going to keep on hopefully putting information out about cool stackable silver because I love that stuff. But, you know, you had the St. Michael's, which I believe is from the same mint. Um, that was a hot, hot item right there. And I thought I thought with the St. Michael's, I'm like, you can't get any better than that. That's the best you'll ever be able to make right there. Everybody's going to love that piece right there. But then they came out with these Aztec pieces, and I'm like, you know what? Those are pretty special, too. Um, this right here, I got the uh, one of the shield pieces that they put out there. Again, very, very detailed. And this is all stuff that I've gotten off of jmbullion.com. Um, you know, you like them. Uh, that website, it pretty much has all the stackable silver you could ever want on there. Uh, what I usually do on JM Bullion, if I'm looking for like stackable silver is I just go to the little search function when I log in there and uh, just type in stackable or stacker. And either way, it comes up with a lot of this kind of stuff right here. And uh, I'm, I'm in love with it. Look how big in comparison to like the two ounce St. Michael's shield. Look how big this thing is because it's just so much flatter. Anyways, I'm, uh, I'm absolutely in love with these things. I think they're really, really cool. Uh, comes with the protective little plastic on there. So if you want to just keep them safe, then that's fine. If you want to be able to stack them, though, you're going to take them out of that plastic and stack them that way. But uh, I highly recommend you grab some of these right here. These are hot. When I recommended the St. Michael's, um, they pretty much sold out. And then the price of them shot up significantly for a long time until they were able to produce more. So... Uh, will that happen right here again? Who knows? But regardless, that is a nice piece right there. And um, if they ever stop making these right here, you're going to be like, man, I wish I had got one of those Aztec pieces. Those are awesome. Anyways, Aztec Sunstone 2-ounce stackers, or you probably look up Aztec Calendar 2-ounce stacker, or just Aztec 2-ounce stacker, and you should be able to find them. Um, again, I'll have a link down below to uh, jmbullions.com's website. So you can just go ahead and find a nice and easy if you are going to pick one up or just check them out there, uh, read some of the story about them. And then if you'd like to go out and find more history about them, because like I said, it's based off of an actual artifact that exists and it's massive. It's huge, a uh, big, huge stone piece that was found. Anyways, I got to go for now. I appreciate you for stacking with me. Spectacular is out. Yeah.